Hello everyone, this is Mauricio here at Tico Laser Creations and today I'm going to be showing you how to do um, a line of uh, circles to do the stitching for your uh, leather patches. Uh, let's say that you created a nice patch then you don't want to glue it into your uh, hat, you want to do a stitch top. Uh, that's really nice uh, you can do it with the perforation line and light burn but there's another way to do uh, do it uh, that works a lot better and I'm saying that because when you do the perforation line all you get is you know the beam uh, from the laser just going you know like one little dot in there and it's only going to be as wide as your laser beam and for leather, sometimes you want something that's a little bit bigger. Let's see this. When you do this, this stitching is a lot easier. Especially because the tread for uh, using in leather is normally wax uh, tread. And um, if you want anything durable, uh, has to be uh, tread, especially for leather. And then uh, it's normally quite thick. So trying to get the needle with the thread through that uh, small little perforation dot from the laser beam is not fun. Now that uh, what you can do is also then basically create a little circle the size of at least the size of the thread. So you measure the thread. In this case, it's about 85 mill uh, 0.85 millimeters, and you all around the patch then you say that takes a long time if I do it manually in live burn it only takes five seconds let me show you on the computer here we are in live burn and what I'm going to do this is the patch I'm going to be working on well at least uh, this is to show you guys what I'm going to do is just select that my uh, outside line the cut line and I'm going to go to the offset tool and uh, make a neural line that is uh, in my case I'm going to use 2.5 millimeter from the edge um, and I'm just gonna say yes once you have that line I'm gonna convert it to blue so we can see it here uh, different and uh, what I'm going to do is figure out where the uh, start point for this shape or this line is and for that, I'm going to come over here to the uh, tool that is uh, immediately above the radius tool. Uh, and what I'm looking for is where does this shape starts? And it's around here. It's important that we know where that is because when we come with the uh, little dot or circle that I'm going to make here, uh, that is... Let's make sure my tread is about 0.8 millimeters so we're gonna change that to for the circle to be 0.8 millimeters so it's just a nice tight fit for the tread and I'm gonna move my circle kind of right in the middle of the line I want it to go around so once that is let me change that to black now I'm going to highlight the circle and I'm going to highlight the line going into a range copy to path and then here you can decide how far apart you want the circles to be uh, I want them to be four millimeters and here we go magic delete that line and here we have it now you have a um, dot or a circle that has been cut for your stitching line all around the same shape as uh, the entire patch and is big enough for the thread to go into it all right i hope that was helpful for uh everyone out there who's trying to do the little dots or circles for the stitching uh of their leather patches and don't forget to subscribe, hit the uh, notification bell for future videos. Until next time, Mauricio, out.